Oh, hello. I didn't notice you there. I'm Avi Burchor. You might recognize me from previous Epic Armory unboxings, such as the last time we got a whole bunch of stuff in. Uh, you may have noticed that we actually do have a whole bunch of stuff in. Uh, unfortunately, there's not much new here today, guys. It's, uh, for the most part, it's gonna be uh, top up order, because oh my god, you guys go through a lot. Thank you, it's amazing. I get to have this wonderful job, and it's all thanks to you guys. We do have two new things to show you, because uh, I am not a crook. <laughs> um, so, first thing is something a lot of you have been interested in, and the great thing about unboxings is the excitement of opening a box. Sadly, these are too large to go in a box. So, it's not quite the Titan Shield. But, by the might of Chrome, we have the new Chrome Shield. And once again, i got to apologize to, uh, to any sword crafties out there. Um, it's kind of too freaking huge for your wool set. You could carry, like, uh, a... a Gaul chieftain who was about to talk to his priest get a fix about conquering some Romans on this thing. It's huge. Like it, it comes with a freaking back strap. It's that big. That's doing weird things to my hair. But oh, like check that. That's massive. It's. I can kind of understand why Swordcraft doesn't want people uh, with something this big. Like, even I can hide behind this to make it... Oh, look, look, there's no legal strike zone now. Ha! So yeah, we've got that, uh, which will make a lovely shield for those of you that don't have rule sets pertaining to shield size, or you want to turn someone into a siege weapon. The other thing, thankfully, uh, going to be a fair bit smaller, a lot more manageable, and it's for those of you that... You know, like you keep on talking to us, and you've been going, Oh, I really like the kite shields, but you just don't have them in my colours, because my warband is a hot pink and green, because we're Decepticons. Man, this one's actually really well packaged. Ah! There we go. Cool. So, for those of you that insist on having like really weird aberrant colours that just aren't really a thing, Oh look! Look! We now have entirely unpainted kite shields. It's still the same tough Epic Armory foam, the high density foam that you've been expecting. We've got the nice just across grip, so you can be like, rah, and you paint it yourself. It's got a special rubberized top coating, which will actually accept acrylic paints a lot better than the pre-latex stuff. So, now you can just make a stencil, for the love of God, make a stencil! I swear, officer, these spray cans aren't just for chroming, they're also so I can pretend I'm fighting orcs. So yeah, uh, that's about it from us today. Hopefully we'll have a bunch of new products to show you next month, because there is some good stuff on the horizon with the hybrid range. Alright, see you guys on the battlefield.